So Ms. Kim deserves to be the uh, Millie Harness Support Person of the Year because she is um, down deep a wonderful human being who feels uh, who's ob who feels obligated to support all people no matter what the situation is. She goes above and beyond to build a relationship for them and to um, uh, to reach back out to them and find any type of resources and just be there for them as um, as people and. Uh, in that gentle heart coming from the heart. That's Miss Kim. Probably 90% of these kids, it's their first experience at school. You know, some of them have been in daycare. A few we have that are coming from maybe a different um, early childhood program, but the majority of them, it's their first experience to real school and just to see their excitement and how they love coming to school and their bright smiling faces and it's it's great and, and, and it's also it's kind of terrifying too. <laughs> you know it's kind of like we and I think that's something I really all of our teachers and paras they really take it seriously and staff everybody that this is the first experience these these students and parents the parents too are having with the school atmosphere and we want it to be a positive one for them and i think we work very hard day in and day out to make it a positive experience for you know both the the students and the families like she just makes um not only her life skills classroom so calm and cool and collected um, she just does it for the whole building. I see what she does and how much care she gives for people. Um, she's just amazing. Like she really deserves this award because she doesn't take any recognition for anything that she does. Well, I, I've been with uh, Hickman Mills District for five years. And the time flew by so fast. I, you know, it's, it's one of those things, you know, like I said, I was a housewife. I thought I would try it. Now you cannot peel me away from these kids. The sad part when they get older and have to transfer to the higher classes, you know, the junior high and, and, and that, you know, that's kind of sad because you do, you become so attached. But other than that, well, I do run into them because I live in the district. So I do run into them at Price Chopper and stuff like that. I hear my name, Miss Dooley, Miss Dooley. And I look around as one of my babies running up to me. So that's great. I love you guys and I miss you so much. I think about them so often. She's, she does it all. Like literally, she helps. She's the, the the silent supporter, like behind the scenes person. Many people um, may not interact with her and may not um, connect with her on a frequent basis. But I mean, she's the key to a lot of um, events and activities taking place, connecting board and community, making sure that the Board of Education has what they need, making sure I have what I need. That's just how special she is, where she makes you want to keep connected with her because of the support and just kindness and love. It is such an honor. It is truly an honor to be nominated. Out of all of the people that work in our district, someone thought enough of me to actually take the time, nominate me. And it is my hope that I, along the way, have made some type of difference and impacted the success of our district. I've worked with some wonderful people, Superintendent Dr. Cargill, Dr. Carpenter, and now Dr. Skinner, who of course helped make things easier for me and give me an opportunity to lead and to grow and to learn. And I appreciate that. And while I hope I win this, um, the Millie Horner Support Person of the Year, I truly do feel honored to be nominated.